my channel so as you probably guessed i'm away at the moment so i'm actually in munich with women's best um but yeah we're shooting for a campaign that's coming up um in munich and i just thought i'd take you along with it so it's my take you along with me um so it's my first kind of press trip kind of thing ever and it's very exciting for me this is a big step actually i was kind of worried about coming but we just had lunch with all the girls and they're like super friendly and really nice so i feel happy i feel confident now and yeah i had a little stalk of all of them before i came i won't lie and i was a bit worried because they all look incredible but yeah i've definitely I definitely get on with all of them and they're all really nice so i feel quite happy um but yeah first up i thought i'd do a little room tour so if you're planning on coming to munich we are staying in the nyx by somebody it's definitely by someone but i can't remember but yeah it's in munich and yeah it's really nice we had we just had lunch as i said and it was really good i just had a salad really boring chicken salad but it was actually really tasty um but yeah let's do a room tour so it's pretty standard as you walk in got a nice little giraffe here cute little ottoman and then you've got loads of hanging space for your clothes and stuff there's um like spare duvets in there in case you get too cold or if you have a sleepover maybe um then we've got this, I haven't actually looked inside the fridge yet. Okay. The mini fridge is not well stocked, clearly. Um, oh, but we got some biscuits. What are these? These nuts? No. I don't even know what they are. Oh, it's coffee. Hold on. Um, don't know what that is. Um, nice little espresso machine. Uh, espresso machine. Coffee machine. Um, then we got a big old TV here. I kind of want to see if this swivels because oh, we have a swivelly TV, which means you can watch it in bed. Ugh, I wish Elliot was here. God damn. Um, but yeah, we got a swivelly TV. We got a nice little flower arrangement. Nice little cacti over here. Um, interesting artwork. Yep, definitely. This door doesn't open. I already tried it. It doesn't work. I guess this hotel accepts dogs because. I mean, that really should be on the door because I am a dog. But yeah, um, nice little crocodile on the wall, I think. And nice big double bed. Well, actually I think it's two, is it two singles stuck together? Yeah, it's two singles stuck together. Then we've got a really nice bathroom. Uh, lots of storage, decent. Ooh, and a hairdryer. Oh, I love it when they give like stuff like this. This makes me very happy. Um, got, you can control the temperature of the room. We've got one of these mirrors. And then we've got a good like beauty mirror too. Um, then we've got some shower gels and shiz. I really like the way this is decorated actually. Um, then we've got a toilet. Standard. It's all very clean and very nice and yeah probably not a very good price but it looks like a good time to me to be honest um but yeah that's pretty much it let's have a look at the view i wonder what the view is saying oh yeah it's a beautiful view just a lot of buildings my little mate down here what you doing honey oh it's the leonardo hotel that's what it's called it's called the nyx leonardo hotel now I do recall. Um, but yeah, what I'm going to do now is basically just have a little lie down. Maybe make a cup of tea or something. But yeah, I've been up since 3am. So I feel quite tired. Um, but I'm just going to have a little nap maybe for an hour or something. Maybe like half an hour. I don't know, just chill out, watch some TV something like that um and then yeah we're gonna go to october first i try and take you along with me but i yeah i think i'm allowed to film um but yeah i'm excited but everyone seems really friendly and i feel happy so 
that's a vibe but yeah i'll speak to you in a bit and hope you're enjoying the video <laughs> Um, I just got back from October 1st with the girls. Um, it was really good. I am feeling tired, like really tired and it was so cold. You can probably tell by my slightly like purple lips right now. But yeah, I had a really lovely time and it was so cool to see. Um, I've never been to October 1st before and it has been something that I'd like to see. Although it wasn't on like my top 10 things to do, if you know what I mean. But it was cool and I'm glad we went. Um, but right now I'm just going to have, I feel really dehydrated from the um, flight. So I've just got some water and I'm going to watch some TV. Um, maybe like have a nap or something. I don't even, it's 6.30. Okay, it's danger nap if I have a nap. Okay, I'm not going to have a nap. I'm gonna just chill. Then I might go to the gym. I'm gonna have some of these. I got these with me. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm just gonna do all that. Oh, I feel like I'm getting ill too, um, which is not cool. But yeah, so that's what I'm gonna do. And I might take you to the gym or. I might just take you through my evening routine. Depends, I'll let you know. Um, but like me and the girls, we all kind of decided that we'd rather have a night in than go out for dinner or anything, which is cool because like I said, I'm really tired. My legs are so dry, that's so weird. Um, so yeah, I'll catch up with you in a minute. So guys, it is now nine o'clock. I just went for dinner with the girls. I didn't end up going to the gym or getting room service because the hotel, ugh, very annoying. Um, they said they had room service and they have it all over their um, little leaflet things. And yeah, basically they don't actually have room service. So that's fun. Um, but yeah, I got, so I am filming a video. Um, which is going to be like testing highly influenced products but in order to do it justice I basically um, I bought the Foreo from ASOS because you can get student discount um, which is a good little heads up but yeah I bought the Foreo um, which is basically a it's just a cleansing brush um, so I bought that because I thought it might be quite I wanted to buy it like now before where's my camera gone out of focus um before i went on this trip just to kind of see what the crack is um and see if it does good things for my skin so my camera lens really dirty what is going on okay what's... yeah my camera lens was super dirty which is nice i think it still is kind of dirty um so it's about me anyway i'm gonna try this now um I might show you how I do it, but yeah, that will pretty much wrap up the vlog. Ugh, what is going on? Be right back, honey. So guys, I just got it out of the box and it feels like really nice and brushy, um, but in a plasticky kind of way. Um, and yeah, then it feels like a vibrator, that's all I'm gonna say, so. I'm not really sure how this is meant to like feel as though it's cleansing your face because right now this is doing 
nothing for me. Um, how is that meant to feel like it's cleansing your face? I don't really get it. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna give this a go. People are lying, I swear. People must be lying because... What? Like, literally what? Why have I spent 80 quid on this? How do you even freaking turn it off? This is ridiculous. Um, yeah, let me go and try it. Let's test this for real. Right guys, so I've just um, dampened my skin like it says to do. I've connected it to my phone and everything. And basically um, it just says to press the button and kind of just go from there. So yeah, let's give this a go. So it's like use it in a circular motion. Um, I haven't put the, what is it called? So it says, It says um, use the Foria cleanser. I wasn't about to. Oops, I wasn't about to spend money on that because I didn't know that this was necessarily going to be very good. I'm not overly convinced, to be honest. It, I feel like this isn't like an exfoliating thing, if you know what I mean. Um, but I didn't. I don't know what I expected either. Um, Let's take your hair because the lighting's a little bit out. I've just done my eyebrows, by the way. Um, so it's not about me. Why are you not working anymore, honey? I mean, I hope my skin's glowing by the end of this, but. I'm just not sure it's going to be. But yeah, I'm just gonna use this and I'll show you after. It's fairly simple to use to be honest. Um, but I'm interested to see what the results are um, in a few weeks. And to be honest, I'm interested to see what my skin looks like after this. My skincare routine isn't like the best. I mean, I barely have one and my skin is fine. Like. I only really get spots if I eat really unhealthy. Um, but yeah, that's where I'm at with that. Um, but yeah, it does feel nice. Don't get me wrong, but I'm not sure I know what the hype is, to be honest. It just feels like, if I'm gonna be completely honest, it feels like I'm rubbing a bullet all over my face that has bristles on it. Um, but yeah, just keeping it real. Just keeping it down to earth with you. Um, so yeah, a bit odd. I'm sure there's like sex toys that people use like this. Yeah, yeah it's a very expensive sex toy, let's put that out there. Um, which I'm actually rubbing on my face. Okay, my skin feels dry, I guess. I guess this is what's meant to happen. Who knows? Maybe I'll, maybe I'll wash it after like I've done this wrong but my skin like don't know don't don't bloody know let me figure out the instructions and yeah but you basically see how it works it's fairly simple to use and feels quite nice well it feels all right doesn't feel like anything special um so yeah I'm just gonna wash my face now